I bet I won't do POS. Run and come here, I 5k. You put 100 now for charge, don't be 50 now again. Every day when I'm going to put money, at 50 now I'll be charged before. You don't add your own now, 100 now. If I ask you now, I go say four money go up. You know they use generator for here now. That's so. <laughs> Allowing your reckless activities in this community does not make me a coward. So stand down. Because I swear by the gods, if I come for you, you will run. So I'm telling you, right here and right now, to reconsider. Else you will do what? Chukudubem. You know, I find it very difficult to comprehend why an acclaimed prince like yourself will be this loud mouthed. I got that wrong here. It beats me. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Hmm? <laughs> Obina, again, I forgive you. I forgive you. I forgive your stupidity. Because I want to give you a second chance. Uh, 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 guy, 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 let me tell you something. Eh? Second chances are a place of refuge for weak men. I'm not a coward. If you get me, you do it now. Obina, running your mouth like this will not help you. It will not. Accept my hand of friendship now that you have the chance. Now that you have the opportunity because a day will come that I will rule this kingdom and everything in it, including you. And believe me, when that day comes, I will come for everyone, including you, that has made my father scold me. Let me tell you something. A wise man once said that a man's ambition does not exceed his worth. Have a nice day. My king to be. Are, are you trying to work out on your future king? Obina! Are you working out on your future king? Obina! Even if you're coming from the air, water, or beneath the earth, I must fish you out and deal with you properly. I don't care what it will take me or how long it will take me. You cannot just come into this town and steal my man from me. Watch and see. I will so deal with you. What is wrong with you? Father, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. That did not answer my question. What is wrong with you? Jumwa? Father, I said I am fine. Obviously, I'm fine. Hope you know you're not talking to a stranger. What is wrong with you? Father, like I said, I am fine. Please, excuse me. What's 
the color of her problem now? Have you forgotten that we still have a lot of work to do today? Eh? Regards the royal, royal guest we're having tomorrow. Exactly why I brought you here. I need your help. And how can a mermaid like me help her royal majesty? And then why are you talking like this now? Uh, talking like how? Eh, tell me, how am I talking? Are you not the one that said that the prince is your man? Hmm? Which automatically makes you the future queen of our kingdom. I believe the one coming tomorrow is going to be his concubine. Rubbish. Please say what you want to tell me go back inside before the queen will start screaming my name. Please. I know I cannot really prevent her from stepping her feet into this palace. Thank God you know. But I can stop the marriage even before the prince gets married to her. And how do you intend to do that? That's where you come in. You know her royal majesty instructed that you be the one to cook the meal they will eat. Mm -hmm. I want you to help me poison her. She know! Why are you screaming? Help me, friend. You will be the one to get it by the time the prince gets married. Will you stop that before, before the, the gods strike you dead? Informa! Hey! Did you just hear the atrocity you just spilled out from your mouth? Hey, Informa! See, I will just go back inside and continue what I was doing. Eh? And I will pretend we never had this conversation. But, be rest assured, if anything happens, to the future queen of this kingdom. I won't hesitate to report you. Rubbish. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know, ultimately, you find that no one can tell the creator how to do his thing. <laughs> I mean, who would have thought that after a two year online dating spell with Naomi that she would just show up here and surprise me like this. Hmm. Who would have thought? I am so very shocked. I am. <laughs> uh, Patience is indeed a virtue. I am. Is. I envy your perseverance, you know. No, you shouldn't. You should just learn. I learned from daddy. Hmm? I know. You know. I'm very happy. I'm happy for you still. <laughs> Papa and Mama, you'll be very proud of you in their grave. Yeah. I know. I have a, I've lived a good life. I'm, I'm, I'm a decent man. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm a good guy. <laughs> I'm good people. You know. Uh. Finally, things are settled. I believe this love of his will calm his spirit. <sighs> Finally, I will be with the love of my life. Ah, brother. Yes. She said she's from this village. Where? Well, she is yet to reveal that to me. I pressed, not like I didn't try. You know, pass now me, tell me, you know, your family name so I can get to meet your people. But she's pretty much like you. She says that she would, you know, now that she has met me physically, she would like to spend time with me and get to know me proper on a personal level. You know. Mm -hmm. Well, that's not bad. Oh, so I'm not to be trusted. I did not say that. So that's what you're implying. That's the insinuation. It's not a bad thing to do, so it means that really, truly, my character could be questionable, so she has to spend time to get to know me more. That's what you've just said. No. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying she give her time. She come around. Ah. Uh, yes. But what about me? I already came around. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Let her take her time. I'm here. Well, my man's parents invited me over. Get out of town. I'm serious. <laughs> See who's getting engaged very soon. Uh, mm -hmm. So you want to leave me in this house? <laughs> Are you serious? I'll come and visit you though. <laughs> this is good news. When are you going to see them? Soon. Soon, soon, soon. Uh, and I hope that after seeing them, that that boy is going to come here. Sure. After seeing his parents, I'll make sure I drag him down. Drag him here. He has enjoyed you too much. <laughs> no more. Ha oh. What? Huh? What? You don't enjoy yourself with him? But what is it? Are you trying to tell me that both of you have not been? What? The... What? Let me speak my mind. Oh. 
I should stop. Okay, j- just bring him here. <laughs> when he comes here, we're gonna have a conversation. <laughs> you know, <I> know. <laughs> uh, but I'm happy for you. So you glow because uh, I was wondering what's the glow? You know, this Aww, sudden you glow. <laughs> Women, you people like love, sha. You love love. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Princess, I'm sorry for coming into your room uninvited. The question is, what do you want? My princess, I saw the way your parents scolded at you when you came back. Because you went out alone. And you were not on your royal apparel. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Who cares? Does it look like I care? I am fine. So tell me what you want. Money, clothes? What? What is it? My princess, I don't want any of those. I want to help you, my princess. <laughs> you. Want to help me? Don't you think that the lady in the castle is supposed to be the one to help this maid? My princess, I think the lady in the castle is in the jungle. No one only the servants who dwells there. My princess, I know every guard in this palace, apart from Ikemba, will do my bidding. So whenever you want to go out, I will send one to follow you, but not to the place you're going to. When you're coming back, he will meet you up. Wow. This sounds interesting. My princess, as for your dressing, whenever you want to go out, you dress like royalty. Once you step outside the palace, you change into anything you want inside your car. And everyone is happy. I like you already. Whoa. Thank you for this strategy. I am happy. Thank you. Hey, you are not supposed to be a maid. I'm flattered. <laughs> You're too intelligent. I'm flattered, my princess. Thank you. Mm. Thank you, my princess. <laughs> my princess. Yes. I beg to take my leave now. Oh, what's that your name again? Ifoma. Ifoma, thank you. You're thank welcome, you, my princess. See you around. Okay. Good night. Princess. Good night. Freeland. Hi, brother. Hmm? Ah, ah. Hey! How, <laughs> how do I look? You look amazing. Hey! <laughs> brother. You look so beautiful. 
Thank you. Uh, let's just hope that the, as you head out, that the king of this um, community does not see you and decide to make you one of his Oh, <laughs> Thank you, brother. And I also want to appreciate you for the nice and beautiful outfit, irrespective okay. of the fact that I told you last night. You still made it possible. Uh huh. That Thank is because you. you're still my responsibility. You're still in this house. Uh, you have to look good. You told me that the young man in question is doing well. So yeah. you have to look the part. <laughs> Brother. Brother. Uh, Thank you. Uh, it's okay. Um, I see that you're all set. Let me drop you off. No, 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 no. Don't worry. I'll I'll, I've made preparations for. Okay, let me just take you to the junction. You no, pick no, a no, car. Brother, don't worry. Continue with your work. I just prepare to meet your brother in law soon. <laughs> I see you have this all figured out. So I'm gonna... I'll see you soon. <laughs> <laughs> you look good. Thank you, brother. Whatever that happens today, I want you to calm down. Yes. You don't have to show that you're sad. Listen. The gods will give you your own man at the right time. What are the both of you talking about? See, Ifoma, we know that you are dying inside. Eh? Knowing full well that another woman is coming to uh, uh, see the person you, you call your man. But I just want you to calm down and don't do anything stupid. Is this why the both of you brought me out here? Yes. We want you to be at your best behavior. Because the royal household will not tolerate any insolent behavior from you. I don't blame the both of you. I blame myself for mingling with non-entities like you. Oh. Okay, well, no problem. We accept, but we still maintain our ground. Don't do anything stupid, though. Don't <laughs> do anything stu stupid. We are warning you. <laughs> it is jealousy that will kill the both of you. Rubbish. May God help this girl before infatuation kills her. Eh? Can you imagine? Up your food. You don't have to be shy. Feel at home and comfortable. This is your husband's to be house. So is your family as well. Thank you, ma. Well, son, you've made us proud. Thank you very much. She's beautiful and well mannered. Informer. Where is the princess? She's coming. Someone mentioned my name. No one did. No one did. Swear to that. I swear. Hi, wifey. Hello. My name is Naomi. I'm Ruth. Welcome. Nice meeting you. So you're the one that uh, stole my brother's heart away, yeah? Listen, if anything happens to him, I will kill you. Do not pay attention to her. She's a clown. <laughs> <laughs> a real clown. <laughs> Bro, I'm proud of you. She's beautiful. Thank you. There's nobody else yet. <laughs> Cheers. Ah, <laughs> so sorry. You see what I told you? She's a clown. You just messed your clothes. Yeah. I 
stop myself. And mom. Uh, Ivoma, please come and assist me. So sorry. That's fine. <laughs> Nice meal, ma. <laughs> yes, because of those outfits. Those outfits are not supposed. No, exactly the measurement I gave to you. I asked you to do it the same way I asked you. I want to discuss something very important with you. Um, oh, no problem, Father. It's okay. I want you to give me the full attention. Okay, Father. I'm listening. Oh, well, Ujuma, I don't want to beat about the bush. And I want you to give me a sincere answer. Because I'm about to become a very powerful and influential man in this community. How close are you to Obina? Um, he's my best friend's brother. So that means he's my friend. Is there, is there any problem? Uh, well, nothing much. It's just that um, I'd want you to monitor every of his movements and report back to me. Father, how is how how am I going to help you achieve your aim by monitoring Obina? Well. Um, I don't need to, you don't need to ask such questions because I've just explained to you. Okay, let me tell you. He is my vendetta. With him, I can achieve my aim of becoming the most powerful man in this community. Father, I can't do that. I, I'm sorry, I have to disobey you. I have feelings for Bina. I am in love with him. So I, I can't monitor his movement. Will you spit that out of your mouth? What do you mean by that? Look, I will not have any man blackmail you emotionally in this kingdom. Just listen to yourself talk. That you're in love with him. Huh? Let this be the very first and the last time you mention this in this house. What do you mean by that? That you're in love with him. Now listen and listen good. Whatever feelings you have for him, let it die now. am I about to produce? A weak princess? It's like you don't know the kind of father you have. Telling me about love. Nonsense. Hello, Frank. Uh, uh, how far? Uh, uh, Frank, Frank, listen to me. I'm not your problem. 
Mba, I, 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 as in I'm boss, eh, when you I give away problem, we're going to have problems. I put you in charge of my bikes for daily return. I am not running a charity organization. Why are you telling me to calm down now? Why are you telling me to calm down? Do you know what time it is? It's almost 2 p.m. You are supposed to come here last night to, 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 to deliver the money they made for the week. Till now, I have not seen you. You are making excuses. Okay, if I don't see you here by 5 p.m. today, I'm going to take those bags from you and give it to somebody else. I'll give it to somebody who is serious to do this place. Uh, what is your problem? My friend, get out of my phone with your silly excuse. Must I tell you everything? Please go when I need you. I'll call. Yeah, my, my lady, see. The money where you they pay me, I feel say the service where they render no reach the value of the money. You understand? Since you say me cannot drive you entire inside, me can just there they wait. I do. I said when I need you, I will call you. Please. No, I, I want to wait for you. See, I'm at your service. I day, I no worry. I day, I day. You still need this job. Hey, no, 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 it's okay. Please, it's, it's okay. Please, it's okay. I, I'll go now. Now, now. I'll go now. Fine. When I need you, I'll call you. Okay, okay ma. Okay. Just be careful, my lady. wrong with these boys they think somebody is out here for 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 for, for, for jokes hey yeah hey <laughs> <laughs> see who caught me Afghan. hi you came here alone <laughs> yes sir where's everybody i'm home alone my sister went on a date with her man i'm so happy for her really yes but when <sighs> we slow down how did you know i was missing you just showed up of course, you know, I miss you too. Come here. Oh. Come. <laughs> hey, you promised me that I'll see her next time. Let's go home. inside. I want to tell you something. Come, 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 come. Did you prepare anything? I could I never tell you I will wait till something. she comes back because I would love to meet her. Ah, you're welcome, Dad. Ah, thank you. Oh, babe. <laughs> Your family are a really nice set of people. And I can't wait to be here fully. Soon, my love. Really? Yes. How soon? How soon do you want it? Um, mm, like tomorrow. <laughs> Consider it done. Babe! You're not serious, are you? Of course I am. Anything for my girl. Mm. <laughs> you know, I can't wait to finally have it to myself. I mean, wake up every morning <laughs> to behold your beauty. <laughs> Same here, baby. <laughs> Don't worry, I've got plans. Mm. My plans are grand. Hope you're not planning something that will Scare me. Ah, come on. I scare you, all right? I know, right? Uh -huh. Always. <laughs> that, that, that makes you my baby. <laughs> Good. Open the gate. We have gone far to start. Nothing can be exchanged. For this love from the beginning, from the moment I met you, I know that you're mine. From the beginning, from the moment I met you, I know that you're mine. Oh, we are tied, tied with love. Tied with love. You make my life so beautiful. Oh, we are tied, tied with love. From the beginning, from the moment I met you, I know that you're mine.
From the beginning, from the moment I met you, I know that you're mine. Oh, <laughs> I'm begging you. To <laughs> I wish. I, I wish. I wish I could just Stay wait. So I can see your Stay sister. Stop <laughs> but you now have to go. I so know. my parents wouldn't be looking for me. I understand. I know she will understand too. I'll let her know. That's okay. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> What is this bastard doing here? Sis, what the hell are you doing here? I asked the question! Hmm? Sis? What is he talking about? Naomi? Are you a princess of this land? I am sorry. I, I was hoping to, to tell you at the right time. What like, time? What is it? What, I hope there's no problem. What is it? Of course, yes! There is a problem! The problem is you cannot marry this bastard! The problem is that you must have a dead wish to come here to go to bed. Leave my father's compound now. You must be very stupid to say that. I swear to God, you must be very stupid to say that. What, what, what is going How on? Dare you come close to my sister, my the princess of this kingdom? So the what is this nonsense? Why are you telling me I cannot? Why are you calling my man? If, why would you do that? Are you, are you all right? Baby, what, what why are you, you here? Why, why would I be here? What the hell are, are you doing here? Why are you calling my man? If, would you have to call him a He's a very big fool. Chill out, Move. Stop. Stop. Move. Stop. 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 Wait for me. Stop. Stop. How come nobody's seen the bigger problem here? Have you all forgotten what the tradition says about an issue like this? Marabina, please stop. Please. Please. Damn the consequences! I don't care! I don't freaking care! like enemies now all is well how can all be well didn't you see the fierce look on the prince's face and how big the princess looked if there is a problem it's none of my business yes <laughs> the only thing i'm praying for is that let the problem be something that is going to make the prince call off his engagement with that ugly vulture can you be positive you former can you ever be happy for someone in your life? Hey, this girl, you will never cease to amaze me. 
I don't even know what to tell you. Honestly. May God have mercy on you, so. And you too. Excuse me. Jealous things. Can you imagine? This girl will die out of frustration one day. Eh? I'd rather date a god than to live a kind of life. Imagine. Where one's right ends is where another begins. <laughs> Who could have believed that all those hawks and kisses of yesterday would turn to sorrow today? This life cannot be predicted. At least I have a chance now. But what if Obina wins? What happens? of ordeal. How do I deal with this disaster? Is it bad to finally fall in love? I thought love was supposed to be a sweet and beautiful thing. So why is mine turning into something else? Why is it proving otherwise? I'm so confused right now. What do I do? How do I handle this situation? I didn't back in for this. I never wanted to fall in love until I met him. But right now, I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do again. What kind of stupid and useless tradition is this? What? what, what? Gods of my ancestors, please. Come to my rescue. Show me the way out of this. Please. <sighs> oh God. What will I call this type of ordeal? How do I deal with this disaster? Is it bad to finally fall in love? I'm so confused right now. What do I do? Let tradition be damned. Whatever it takes, I am willing to do for love. my blood, my sister. You have been sleeping with my biggest enemy in this community, Chine Inye, and you call yourself my blood, and you couldn't tell me? Please, I'm sorry. You're sorry? I'm sorry. I was so scared. I didn't huh? know what to do. 
I was going to tell you. I was going to tell you. I just wanted to give it time. What? Ta what? What? What time? What other time? I sleep in this house with you. You cook my food. I run around as your brother to make our life comfortable. You and I live here. What time? Were you waiting for time to stand still before you tell me that you've been sleeping with my enemy? Where was time when that young man demolished the workshop that I inherited from our father? That didn't touch you. Where was time when he, he, he relayed my boys and, and seized my bike? Bike, IG, leave me. Where was time? Where was time when he brought war to my, to my doorstep? Where was time? And you stand here talking about time. Please, please, let's just be reasonable here. Why are you so dumb? No, you are the one who needs to be reasonable. You are the one who needs to be reasonable. You are just a bag of emotions. You let your heart go before your head. How can you do this to your brother? Please, I promise. If he gets married to me, we are going to fix everything that you did. Please, I'm sorry, brother, please. You have got to be the biggest idiot that I know. If he gets married to you, oh, you think that I'm going to be alive and allow Dubem marry my own blood? You are stupid. Let me tell you something. If I see you with that boy again, I will beat the life out of you. No, brother. Yes, again, eh? This is what I cannot take. I, I can respect you to any length, but not you coming in between my, my relationship. The prince has engaged me. You cannot compare it to, to, to your, your Instagram. Hey! You are to me. Me! Moa! Oh, so you, are, you now talk back at me. Ha! I have fed you and you have grown. And now you have the strength to break your brother's heart. Let me see you with that boy again. Let me catch you with him. I will make sure he attends your burial because I will kill you with my bare hands. Idiot. <laughs> You mean he pointed the gun at the prince again? Father, I was so shocked to my bone marrow where I was hiding. He didn't just point a gun at him. He almost shot the prince today. It's like my tool. It's acting more than it should. Well, when the drummer changes his beats, the dancers changes their dance steps. Uh, Father, I hope all these um, proverbs of yours has nothing to do with Obina. You see, Ikenta, the great hunter, does not explain everything he sees in the forest. You have done your bit, my child. Go and rest. Let your wise father take it up from here. Uh, father, Let please, you. I beg you with anything that you hold dear to your heart. Don't carry this your wonderful agenda and go close to my Obina. Father, are you listening to me? Father. Okay, yes. Um, yes, I would like to see you tomorrow morning. It's extremely important. Yes. <laughs> the two elephants have positioned themselves for battle. Yes, we need to see you tomorrow. It's very important. Yeah, no problems. It's okay. I'm on it. For how long will you continue like this, Sam? Ever since you came back with your sister, both of you have refused to talk to each other. Not even to come out to eat as usual. Eh? Sam, we understand your pain. But you, on the other side, have to understand and respect our tradition. 
It has been there for years. Your father is the king of kings. So he is not to go contrary to our tradition. Besides, the consequences are not friendly at all. So what are you saying in essence, mom? One of you must let go. Dad, I can't believe you just say that. I mean, I can't believe this is up for debate. When did she meet this guy? It's barely three months since she came back. And now you want to compare it to a girl I already got engaged to? Oh, come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. It's just a matter of understanding between both of you. She is not just your sister, but your twin sister. If anyone should know you better or understand you better, she is the one. So, both of you should find a way to resolve this problem without creating a sin. Your father has sacrificed a lot to have this throne. Remember, like I said earlier, that he is the king of kings. All eyes are focused on him to make a little mistake. Please, my son, do not allow that to happen. One of you should step down for the other. Please. Listen, sis, I believe everything is going to be fine. I know with time, you will get over this. Huh? Do you want me to get over what? I know you like that boy. But the truth is, time will heal your wound. All right? I believe nature will provide you someone more suitable. So what are you saying in essence? <laughs> Sis, you know I already engaged my girl. And according to the law of the land, we're not supposed to marry from the same family. I made the marriage move first. So I'm begging you as my sister to please leave that boy. All right? He's not, he's not good for Could you. Would you just shut up already? Shut up! Shut up! This is why you, you came here. Just stand up and leave before you get me angry anymore. Get up and leave. I'm really trying to be very diplomatic about this. Don't forget, I am the heir apparent to the throne of this kingdom. You just said it. Heir apparent. Meaning you will soon become the king of this kingdom and you can get any girl that you want or every girl will come to you to be, I am saying this, just do this for me. Step down for me, that's all I ask. Step down for me. Can't you do it for family? Can't you do it for your own twin sister? Step down for me. You know, you must be very stupid to say that to me. Didn't you get the part that says, oh, we're already engaged? You can disengage her. Engagement is not marriage. Disengage her and do it for me. That it, it is. It, Hard to do? do we, is this hard to Am I asking for too much? Naomi, you make me laugh. Now you want me to throw away a relationship I have built all my life. For what? Your premature love.
I'm giving you till the end of today. Think about your life. Leave that boy, else you will face my wrath. Dibem, you can't threaten fire and brimstone for all I care. Fool's talk. But wise men listen. And let me educate you. You see that relationship you call premature? It means the word to me. That, that relationship is, is something I've built all my life. It's like my life. That's why I am begging you, step down for me. What is yourself? And I say it is not possible. It is impossible. Why do you like using your position as an elder brother to intimidate me? Why? I'm advising you. I'm advising you something that would help your life. You call it intimidation. Let me tell you, Ruth. The reason I'm being very lenient with you is because of the bond that we share as siblings. If not, I would have smacked you. I'm telling you that you're not going to marry that fool and you're arguing with me. Let me advise you. The earlier you get that idiot out of your head and move on, the better for you. And you're in the position to marry his sister, right? Of course. Why, if I may ask? That is because you don't have issues with Naomi. Let me tell you another thing. Even if... Even if I was not in a relationship with Naomi, not in this lifetime would I let you marry that fool. It's like you've forgotten that this man in question has just engaged me. And there is nothing you can do about it. Not even Papa will say anything from his grave I will listen to. No, this are no peace. Oh, leave, me, leave me alone in this house to so have peace. Oh. You no, dare to bring Papa into this. <laughs> you, you dare to bring Papa into this. <laughs> eh? You dare to bring Papa. You are, you are talking back at me. Idiot. Because I'm still of the opinion that we should not accept the terms slated by the Guru Kingdom. I mean, those things are too big for them for my liking. Besides, they are going to benefit immensely from the project. What I'm saying in effect is that reconsider your stand. Don't sign the documents. Uh, Onyeze, Your Majesty. Awon onbo nga yo chi nya lo ma ka na ogo mma na omu nwe mmeli. One does not fast and pray to his God to be with him in a fight he is assured of winning. Your Majesty, you know we are capable of beating these people blue black if the matter comes. As a matter of fact, Your Majesty, they cannot dare challenge knowing how powerful we are. <laughs> See, a man has a thousand healthy and fast horses in his pen. And you, Ezekiel, has just one horse. Now, a time for game draws near. And the man with a thousand horses comes to you that he needs your horse, the only one you have, for the race. What will you do? Knowing full well that the man has a thousand healthy horses. Oh no, what manner of stupid man is that? Before I can let that horse out of that pen, the man must sign some documents assuring the safety of my horse. What if my horse does not make it back alive? What has this your stupid story to do with what we are discussing here? Ezekiel, Ndiko, in the Kuro community represents the man with the one horse.
please, let us forget this matter. And let us think about how we're going to kickstart this project. When? Because I just don't understand what to... That you are before the king and the royal cabinet. Do you? What's the meaning of this? Maybe we should stop now. Prince. And you, where do you think they will be? My elders, please, I'm very sorry for what's happened. On behalf of my children, I apologize. I promise that it will not happen again. What happened today will never happen again. Please, we are sorry, sorry. You just have to, you just have to. Sorry. Hey. Your, your Majesty, you don't have to. You don't have to. You don't have to. This is a heavy one. But I would advise you to take things easy on your brother. You know, he's the only family you've got. But he's not seeing it that way. I mean, how could... How could Obina be this, this, this selfish? The prince has engaged me, but he just met this girl. Hey, it will not work. I will not allow it to happen. Never. Never. Ruth, just, just calm down. I would not want you to be a loggerhead with your blood brother over this issue. Loggerhead, you mean? <laughs> but you know, it's like you don't know me. I will fight to any length to keep what belongs to me, no matter how long it takes. What of Prince Dubemi? Is he willing to fight? My Dubem would do anything to keep me. That I am sure of. Then allow him to fight. Allow him to fight your sister. Why do you make peace with your brother? Yes, allow him to fight. Ojunwa, you mean I should sit down, fold my arms, and watch Dubem fight this battle alone? <laughs> and what would that make me? Eh? A coward, of course. And I'm sure you don't want me to feel that way. Just, just calm down, oh. Take, take it easy, it's okay. <laughs> Ifoma, <laughs> are you normal? Who is amusing you? <laughs> you're saying something very important and you're here laughing and smiling. Are you sure this girl has no romance? Exactly. What? You are laughing and smiling when there is no comic activity going on here. You think so? Uh-huh. So everything that has been happening in this palace is not comic enough. <laughs> Ifoma, so you mean to tell me that? Or you mean to tell us that? You are happy about the whole marriage saga going on in this palace? Extremely happy. Eh? Why won't I be happy knowing fully well that the ghosts are by my side? Imagine. And what is that supposed to mean? It means that the ghosts are using this medium to tell my man, the prince, <laughs> that I am the right bride made for him, not a gold digger. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> you can laugh for all I care. When it will happen, 
the both of you will beg to be one of my Ashwebi girls. <laughs> beg you. Keep dreaming. <laughs> Just keep hey. on dreaming. <laughs> if for my hey God. It's not only yeah. Ashwebi girls. Eh? Even royal mothers of the day. Thank you. <laughs> look, 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 at, look at this one. Eh? Whatever. <laughs> I'll be the one to put the crown on her head. <laughs> if over. Stop talking. <laughs> look at you. Eh? your question who the hell do you think you are you think you can come between me and my love what the hell are you doing with my sister what are you talking about i'm asking you a question what the hell are you doing with my sister are you asking me what i'm talking about oh you don't you don't know what i'm talking about you cannot stop me from marrying the love of my life you will not stop me is that why you're touching me of course I, I, i'll touch you again who the hell you, you want to fight hey. My princess, bordering in anger is a thing for the weakling. The age of your sword has been roughened. Just simply take it to the blacksmith to sharpen. So what are you trying to say, Fama? It's simple. Live today, fight tomorrow. You've not lost yet. This fight, this fight is not something you should take a break. It's not. Everything in life has a break point. You push, you fall back and we strategize. That is mastering your act's will. If I you know, sometimes I do not know why you are a maid. No one can change nature. But I think nature will change my soul. I hope so. If only you knew you were the missionary for me to achieve such feat. <laughs> you are a bastard! <laughs> Just try me in this part. <laughs> <laughs> and imagine the one who said she is the princess. You are the Mickey Mouse! There's nothing you can do. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful drama. Beautiful rendition from our twin actors. <laughs> Don't mind them. <laughs> hey! <clears throat> As you all can see now that everything is falling in place. Mm -hmm. Everything is moving according to plan. Yes. Now, um, from the information I gathered, mm. This young man, Obina, is a very fearless young man. Very soon, this battle will turn bloody. In that case, he might kill the prince. And that will be the greatest news of the century. <laughs> Wonderful. Now, you now see the reason I want us to just sit back as spectators. This is the reason. Honestly, Shifibe, if you were to be a woman, eh, as we speak, my wife would have been in their home. Hmm? I would have sent her packet and come to you and ask for a hand in marriage because, you see, your intelligence, your wisdom, your smartness, unquantifiable. Hey! You can say that again, Ichi Eirondo. Uh, and that is the reason we call it Igwe. In the making. Igwe in the making. It makes me feel better. Um, one more thing. Okay. I want us to get indirectly involved in the lives of these warlords. Okay. Obina, the princess, 
and the prince himself. Mm. Our master, what do you want us, your students, to do? My love, are you confirming to me that Obina did this to you? Baby, this is a man's battle. Allow us to fight this out. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Don't tell me that. Evil people can only triumph when good people do nothing. I cannot sit down and watch Obina do this to you. I've been considerate a lot, but it seems he's not coming forth. How can I let him tarnish everything I've worked for, the relationship I've built for over years? I have to step in and fight in this battle. No. No. I can agree to any other thing you say, but definitely not this one. Huh. Okay? <sighs> Listen. I will not always be there to protect you at all times. I will not forgive myself if something bad happens to you. So stop. Just stay out of this, please. So you mean I should just sit down, fold my arms and watch you fight this battle? Look at me, look at my face. It's just a little scratch. Huh? There's nothing serious there. Forget, forget about it. Just forget about it. I'll take care of it myself. Hey. Oh, God. Hey, Obina is looking for my trouble. Obina is looking for my trouble. He will get the, the other side of me in that house. So I will not let him breathe. Oh. He will see the madness he's looking for. Hey, oh, <laughs> no problem. Okay. Relax. Yeah? Don't worry yourself. He's just a young man suffering from beautiful exuberance. Yeah? It's okay. My darling. I assure you that I am not going to let anybody make a mess of the two years that we have put in building this beautiful thing that we have. Who does he think he is? Who? Because he's been named the crown prince of this kingdom, he thinks he, he's now the king? Not knowing that I can cause his downfall. But you won't do that. Huh? Like I said, he's a young man. He has his head in the clouds. He thinks that he's a fortress, but I am going to show him that even a fortress has a soft underbelly. Hmm? Come on. We'll have this under control. My love. Yes, baby. I am sorry. Listen, I am giving you my word. I will make sure that I get my father to give us his blessings. It's a promise. And I believe you. You worry too much. It's okay. It's fine. Okay, stop being upset. Come on. It's okay. You know, I've trusted you and your boys for many years now. That is why I'm calling. There is an important task that I want you to handle. The prince of my kingdom needs to be taken care of. He's the one standing between me and my ultimate aim. Yes. You see, <clears throat> um, someone is likely going to do the job, but I want to have a plan A. He'll be going to a peacekeeping treaty with your know of this kingdom. So I want you to be on the standby in case the plan A fails. Yes, so just get your voice ready. I wait my call. It's okay. All right. Okay. Bye.
Juma. Why is your face like this? Why are you crying? It's nothing, I'm fine. Is it Obina? Is it Obina because I am mad at him right now? Why? What, what did he do? Answer my question. Is it Obina? What did he do to you? I, I went to the house to give him this food. Only for me to get there. I saw him hugging and kissing the princess. You say? He's with that fool. You mean he's with that fool in the house? Yes. She's dead. She where are you going dead. To, where are you going to? My lord, I'm getting scared by the day. These children might end up hurting themselves. It's not only about hurting themselves, but tarnishing the image that took us many years of hard work, sufferings, and sacrifices. I don't know what is to do with those children. But if any of them tries tarnishing my image, I will make sure I lock that person away forever. Listen to me, I cannot afford to lose this throne for anything, not after deep sacrifices. I can't even fathom the reason for the hatred they have for themselves. My Lord, is there nothing we can do in order to help solve this situation? To solve the problem? I think the only option left now is to persuade one of them to step down for the other. Don't you understand that I am a custodian of the customs and traditions of our people? And I am the king of kings. All eyes are watching, even for any tiniest error. Can't you understand that? Things are getting out of hand already. I already have a bad feeling. Oh, please, woman. If you don't have any other thing to say, go out there and take some fresh air. Better still, convert that your fear into talking energy to speak to any of them, okay? Your Majesty, I really think that we need to do something very urgently. Something needs to be done as soon as possible before words will go out there that the great hunter is no longer capable of protecting his forest. What option has a rabbit when he comes back and realizes that a python has taken over its hole? Your Majesty, as long as the rabbit is still very much alive and strong, it has the option of digging another hole. Yes, Your Majesty. The rabbit needs to dig another hole. The sky is dark. Oh, Lord, this is a sign of the job. Can do work together. Except they agree. Oh, this is total war. Oh, We've been furious all along, and you wouldn't say what the matter is. It's nothing to worry yourself about. I'll do a transfer for you. Please take it easy. Fire! This is getting out of hand. You need to. Oh. Hey! 
Dubem, Dubem, Dubem. You will have to explain to me. You will have to explain to me, Dubem. Dubem, you will have to explain to me. Wind down and explain to me. You need to tell me what you went there to do, Dubem. I'm not joking. You will tell me who gave you the guts to talk to the man. Come down and tell me who gave you the guts to talk to my man like that. Why would you have to fight my man? I'm asking you, you will not ignore me. Answer me. If you don't get out of my path now, I will descend on you mercilessly. What? What did you say? You did mad? What are you saying? You will not do it. I am ready for you. Do them. I am ready for you. Ah. Ah. You you want to die? Do you, do you want to die? Do you, do you, do you want to die? Do you want to die? I am ready for you to them. Do you want to die? I am ready for you to them. I am ready for you to them. I am ready for you to What's your problem? What is it? Both of you should go inside now. You. I said go inside. Princess. Prince to bed. You both know the tradition of this kingdom. I hope you don't want to incur the wrath of Ochiara. What is wrong with both of you? What is even your problem? Aren't you both ashamed of yourselves? Move! Your Majesty, I am very sorry for this ugly situation. Please, forgive. <sighs> and what are you people still doing there? Will you get out? Idiots! Look at them! Fools! Really? Oh! So you, you allowed her to leave? You allowed her to go, right? You should have allowed her to stay back and wait for me to meet her yet. Hey! She would have experienced the other side of me that you two have not seen. You're shouting. You are shouting. I advise you, go inside and stop screaming here. If you continue this way, I am not, I'm going to deal with you. Else what, Obina? What will you do, Obina? Because you're my elder brother, so what? No, is that no, why no, you're no, no, Slow down. What, did you just call me by my name? And I'll call you that. You just called me Obina. Why would I call you? Is that not your name? Why will you be terrorizing me in this house because you're my elder brother? Why? Listen, let me just tell you. I am like a tigress whose cup has been taken away. I will give you my full dosage of madness in this house if you don't stay away from my man. What happens to Uju here? Uju who has been nothing but a good girl showing and expressing her feelings towards you. What, 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 what are you doing? What did you do? Instead of me to listen to all her pleas to you, you are here forming stupidity. You're stupid. I am going to slap your spirit out of your body. Oh, you think you have grown, eh? You think you have grown? When I slap you, I will slap you again. When I slap you, I will slap you again. You slap me. I am going to slap you again. I am going to slap you again. I'm going to slap you again. Stay away from me. You slapped me because of that stupid girl. Eh? You're talking to me. You're talking Obina. to me. Okay. You will receive the full dosage of my madness in this house. You. I see this was what you do. You. You have to stop coming here. Stop coming here, you cheap prostitute. I see this is what you do. You go around this community with your cheap self, looking for a man to sleep with. And then you bring yourself here. Why are you here? Stop coming here. Stop coming here, because not in this lifetime would I reduce myself to get a man to a cheap ball like you. Stop coming, stop, stop coming back and bring you food here. Stop it. Obina! Hey! 
You are looking for my trouble in this household. You are looking for my trouble in this household. You will receive the full message of my madness. Obina. Obina. Hey. Hey. Okay. This house will not contain both of us. I, I, I'm promising you that. Of this, of this kingdom, Umuna talk on community. So, have I become that small to you? Um, calm down, Your Majesty. Calm down so that you will not have high blood pressure. What other high blood pressure is greater than what this uh, uh, is called themselves my children are giving me? Uh, King of Kings. The lion is not supposed to raise its voice. Shouting the way you are doing right now demeans your authority as the king of Umunapa kingdom. My lord, pronounce your judgment right here and now. And I, he came back. The Ochiaga of this great kingdom will carry it out to the latter. Pronounce your judgment. He came back. You have to quench down His Majesty's anger. It has not gotten to this point. Besides, this is a family issue, a family affair. Any matter that demeans the fame of the king, the great king of this kingdom, Umunato, is no longer a family matter, but has become a personal matter. And I, he came back, we treat it as such. My king, I am still waiting for your instruction. Pronounce your judgment this very minute and I will carry it out to the latter. Just say it. Oh, it's all right. He came back. Your Majesty. Yes. Are, are you sure you are okay? I am fine. Um, please, can you just excuse us? As it pleases you, my king. Now, Dubem, tell me, what solution do you have to put this madness to a stop? Tell me! First of all, I'm sorry for all the stress this girl has really put you through. Excuse me? Is this you excluding yourself? Yo, shut up, girl. I'm still talking. Don't tell me to shut up! Don't do it! Are you older than me? Don't do it! Enough! Well, Father, as I was saying, I have a plan. And that plan is simple. She will have to step down. Because I already engaged my girl before she met that idiot. You're a compound idiot. First class fool. Let me tell you something. I will not step down for you. Not in this life. Not in another life. There she goes again, father. Calling me names. Do you remember I will call you whatever that I like? And you will not do anything. You will not do You replace it. You will not do anything, you will not do anything! Yes! I said you will not do anything! What are you talking about? What is this now? Do me! Do me! I said you will not do anything! Do me! 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 I descended so low to make sure you are happy. I do things that normally I cannot do for any man. But what did I get in return? You gave me the worst insult of my life just because I love and care about you. Don't worry, Obina. I have learned my lesson and in a very hard way. I will no longer bother you with my feelings again. But be rest assured that since you humiliated me, I will make sure that I do everything within and within my powers to make sure that, that your relationship with Naomi does not materialize. Instead of her defeating me in this game, 
I'd rather put you in a tight corner that you will hardly escape from. The sky is dark. Oh, this is a sign of the door. Got to walk together. Except they agree. Oh, this is total war. Oh, this is total war. This is no more a joke. No good in war. Oh, the red and We're going to quench this fire. Fire. Ujumwa, why is your face like that? Did anyone hurt you? <laughs> Father, you won't understand. Oh. Ujumwa, talk to me. I'm your father. What is going on? Talk to me. What is it? Oh, Father. Father, this daughter of yours has been very foolish. Father, you remember you told me to be flocking with egos. Father, I didn't listen to you. I went ahead and enhanced my relationship with chicks. Father, I have wandered far away. But right now, I am back home. Yes, Father. I I'm still confused. What's the sense of all this confession? Father. Father, what is paramount now is that I am ready to flock with eagles and I'm ready to help you achieve whatever aim that you want to. Well, in that case, you have been forgiven. Come to me. Come to my bosom. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you. I'm so happy. So? Now tell me, Father, mm. what is this great plan of yours? Well, um... Since we are now on the same page, okay. let me reveal it to you. I wish to become the king of this kingdom. Huh? Yes. And you, the princess. Ha! <laughs> I can't believe this. Uh -huh. Father, I cannot believe I have been so ignorant of this your wonderful plan because of my stupidity. Ha! Father, you know what? I don't need to ask you how. Because I trust you. You are smart. You're my father, of course. I believe you. Father, all you need to do is to tell me the character you have scripted for me in this episode of yours. Obina. I know it's shocking for you to see me in your compound today. But not to worry. I'm here in peace. I actually came in respect to the fracas between you and the prince. Chief Ibe, if the royal family have asked you to come here to bargain with me, let them know that I am not interested. <laughs> Obina, do I look like a puppet to you? I actually came to see you because I share the same opinion with you. What a opinion do you share with me? What are you talking about? Obina, I know that the throne has been unfair to you. Now, look at it from this perspective. The prince has everything at his disposal, just like the story of David and Uriah in the Bible. But the prince does not want you to have anything that you should desire in this kingdom. What do you think that I desire? Obina, I'm an ambitious man. Scratch my back, I scratch yours. Chifibe, I want you to cut to the chase and tell me exactly what you want from me. Hmm. 
I have been watching this drama from afar off. But, you see, a sensible elderly person cannot be home and watch a she go to deliver in tetas. I will be the last person to see you cheated. Eche, thank you very much. Obviously, you're the only one on my side. Oh, my prince, don't mention. What? What am I for? If not to support you. As a matter of fact, I have spoken to your father privately, but his reply was not encouraging. He kept saying, uh, one of them will step down, one of them will step down. But it is not over. I can't believe my father cannot sanction a decree in my favor. You see, there comes a time in the life of a man hmm, that he has to jettison the advices from his parents. Even right there in the Holy Book, it is there. Right there. It says that, therefore, a man should leave his father and mother and cleave unto his wife. The Holy Book never said, follow your parents. No. My prince, my advice is, fight for the love of your life. Hmm? It, is, it is the meaning that a common, a commoner, a common commoner should be contesting with you, the prince of this kingdom. No, it is not fair. Thank you very much, Uche, for rejuvenating my strength. I truly appreciate this. Okay. You are welcome, my friends. Any day, any time. Ichi Irundu will always stand there for you. Come read, come soon. <laughs> I will make you happy for this. Thank you very much. I'll see you soon. All right then. Bye bye. It's okay, man. Big one, my guy. Hey! Um, it's easy, girl. My princess. Are you sure that all that you have told me is actually going to work? My princess. Yes. You mean that all this that I, Ichi Ezekiel, has been telling you, you are doubting it. A whole me, a member of the Igwe in council. You are doubting what I told you. Uh, I didn't say so. I'm only asking because I do not want to make any mistakes. So I'm just trying to be careful, that's it. Um, my princess. Yes. You see? All that I have told you. Don't add. Don't reduce. Just do it the way I told you. And it will work out perfectly well. I mean, perfectly well. Hmm? Hmm. Wow. Wow. I like this. Mm. It's really interesting. Eche, thank you very much. Thank mm -hmm. you. Um, Eche, give me your card number. I, I want to reward you. Huh? Call your card number for me. My princess, did I hear you say you want to reward me? She just give me your account number. I was even thinking that uh, these drinks and uh, meat, that is enough reward. But nevertheless, <laughs> I'll give you. All right, give me. I'll give you. Um, it's your um, credit. 6 2 6 2 3 What bank? Standard Bank. Oh. <laughs> okay, Ichi, I just uh, sent you something. Just mm. manage it. It's called um, Thanks for Coming. Uh, thank you very much, you my princess. Welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> it has entered. 200,000. My princess. 200. <laughs> Hey, my princess, you know what? I'm with you now. 
from now onwards, count me in. Wherever you go, whenever, call on me, okay. and I'll be there. Okay. Thank you very much, my You're princess. Welcome. You are the only person I know. <laughs> in this life, eh, one needs to trust his chi. Yeah, Madam Ifoma, why are you acting like you've won the uh, battle? Ifoma is just a little dispute, so don't get too excited. My problem with you girls is that your timidity cannot be quantified. If only your myopic eyes can be open to see what's my pipeline, you will know I'm already the winner. If you are what are you talking about, Ifoma? Ifoma, what do you have up your sleeves? Eh? One don't need to pinch a parcel that will obviously be open. <laughs> mm. You needed to see her. Eh? You needed to see how she was concurring to my deceptive strategies. <laughs> <laughs> Out of excitement, she asked for my account number. Okay. I thought it was a joke. I gave it to her. Mm. Guess what? Mm -hmm. She transferred 200,000 into my bank account. 200,000? <laughs> and she called it, thanks for coming. Is it okay? You sent some into my account. Uh, don't go there, don't go there. You see, right. as for the other idiot, hmm? I did not know that he is planning to rule this great kingdom without his chicken brain. Uh, eh? I told him to forget about advices from his parents mm -hmm. and fight for love. Yes. He was busy nodding his head like an agamba lizard. <laughs> eh? Not knowing that he was not even thinking anything. But Thanks to the gods of our lands, mm -hmm. eh, that we have someone like you, our great master. <laughs> yes. um, nice one, everybody. You see, um, as expected, mm. Obina refused to work with us. Huh? But nothing to worry about. Everyone has a prize. Yes. Sure. Mm -hmm. Sure. There's nothing to worry about. I, I cannot believe it that someone turned you down. I mean, that Obina turned you down. It's like you went, you went soft on him. Truth be told, mm. if not that someone existed, mm. that young man deserved to wear the crown of this kingdom. Mm. He is smart, intelligent, but I am 100% ahead of everyone. You can say that again. <laughs> we trust you. So, we know what you can do. Yeah. So, um, like I said, there's no cause for alarm. I have a way of bringing him over to work with us. Oh, we trust you. We know your capabilities. <laughs> yeah. One more thing. Mm. My daughter has just joined the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. Wow! Yes. She will now act as our informant. <laughs> Is it good? Yes. That this is great news. Great news. This is great news. Great news. Yes. Ah, yes. Mm. <laughs> 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 is it? Ah, yes. 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 My daughter can do. Oh, I like, like father, father, like, like daughter. Ujumwam, my chief informant. <laughs> the only lady in the league of extraordinary gentlemen. <laughs> um, we waited for you to celebrate with us, but you were not forthcoming. We put calls through to you. You were not even taking your calls. Father, I am so sorry. You know, when you enter a critical scene, mm -hmm. you have to be extremely careful. Sure. Well, I was busy igniting the heat in Ruth, pushing her to deal with her brother properly. Mm -hmm. That's what I was doing. And? Ah, you know, she's, she's, she's a big fool. She did exactly what I asked her to do. <laughs> you see, a dragon does not give birth to anything that does not spit fire. 
anything for you, Father. I can always count on you. Of course, Father, you can. I'm just, your daughter. Just keep up the good work. <laughs> anything for you, Father. Uh, one more thing. Whenever you're visiting that house, make sure you go with your phone. Okay. Yes. In case you see anything that would be beneficial to our plans, you just secretly record them. So long as it's going to help us to get what we're looking for. Father, <laughs> Father, ah, mm -hmm. I see you is beating that your smartness. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, Father, I will do just that. It's okay. I'm always following your lead, of course. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like daughter, like father. Exactly. That's why they call me the game master. <laughs> <laughs> master. <laughs> yes. Wow. Um. Kill a general, you must attack his house. In other words, to hit Dubim, I must attack his source of happiness. <laughs> That which this game is being played seems to be an easy move. It is time to press the hard core button. What are you trying to say, Chief Yondo? Your Majesty. What I'm saying is that. A mere commoner. A mere commoner is contending with your son, the prince and the heir apparent to the throne of this kingdom, and you are doing nothing about it. And uh, what do you advise her do? Oh, your majesty is very, is very simple. Very, very simple. He's an average man. An average commoner for that matter. The mere mention of 10 million, 15 million, 20 million will freeze him. He will instantly forget about the thought of getting married to your daughter without thinking. That's all. It's a rondo. Are you trying to tarnish the image of the king? What's the meaning of that question, Neoshaga? You and I know that tradition forbids the king of kings from getting involved with bribery. State your mission. State your mission before I deploy the king's offer into action. I believe you know what that means. Achiaga, we are only trying to profess solution to the king. Besides, Nothing discussed here will go outside there, except you go out there and spill. It's okay, it's okay. I mean, this is uh, 
peaceful meeting. And um, we must aid our king. Your Majesty, this matter already is getting out of hand. And if you don't do anything, Your Majesty, and allow this fight to continue, you might lose the image you are fighting so hard to protect. Your Majesty, I'm of the opinion you get that boy arrested. Arrest him and lock him up. It's either you lock him in a police cell or in the royal dungeon. Then you plan a royal wedding for the prince of our kingdom. Um, at times, I wonder if you elders spill all this nonsense deliberately. Have you all forgotten that that boy you advised to be locked up is the only surviving family member of that girl in question? Have you forgotten? And now you want to demean the royal household by bringing a bride that her bride price was not paid into this palace? Huh? Chief Ibe, it's quite unlike you to keep quiet in a, in a discussion like this. Your Majesty, critical situation required critical thinking. That's what I see.